worthless, dumb slut, faggot, punk. They called her number 146. Maybe you know the sting like razor blades. Maybe the desire to disappear, it resonates. Maybe you too know the feel of forgettable. That ache that lingers inside you like the taste of a last cigarette on the tongue. Like the pain in your body because the work is never done. Maybe you know the sound. The sound of your dreams being crumpled into the dollar in someone else's jeans. Like when your parents or your friend or the man down the street tried to pimp your self-esteem. At first, they called you pretty. Then they called you weak. Good for nothing, never be worth much. Every syllable in your beautiful name and the story behind it exchanged for slurs. They've broken down your spine sanded down your shine and branded you with their labels. Next, they'll put you in a box to put you on the shelf, hoping you'll be picked before your expiration date, but, but your soul is not damaged goods. We won't be fooled by those who only care about us long enough to make money off us, make us packageable, profitable, those who treat people like products, turning children into chattel, the vulnerable into victims, and, and maybe you've been told you deserve this. That this is all you'll ever get, so shut up and be happy. Be happy somebody wants you. But you will not be happy with bare minimums. You will not be bought and sold at a discount. Don't count your past against you. A few mistakes just gives your skin that human hue. The hue that says, I've been put into dark places and did not stay there. So don't dance in their dark rooms. Don't pose for their cameras because your portrait's worth a thousand words. All more beautiful than the ones you were told. Irreplaceable, unconquerable, unstoppable. You might be fractured, but unlike a fraction, you cannot be reduced. Tell them. My life is not mathematics. I'm not a statistic, not a hashtag, not a price tag. I am not a number. I have a story. A story that includes love. And survival is just the beginning. I don't have all the answers or any easy solutions. And I don't really know how this ends. But your story is yours. It's what's behind the eyes and cannot be commodified.